How are we doing gamers? Today I'm going to be doing an updated tutorial on how to install Life Still on Minecraft Bedrock Edition. Now this is for this is for computer, mobile, and console edition. Now I just want to bear in mind before we start, uh for console edition, it is a bit difficult nowadays. On PlayStation and Switch, it's impossible. There's no, like, web browser. You can't download stuff on the web browsers and all this stuff. But on Xbox, it is possible we have to lose. But you have to use kind of a janky method. But do not worry. Hope, bear with. I do have a method for the Xbox players. So, here are the timestamps on screen for, you know, what you what, what device you're on. If you would like to skip the boat, skip the those. But if you're on PC, then this, then we're going to start the tutorial right now. So, what we're going to do is we're going to go on to mcpedl dot com and we're going to type in live still. Now, we're going to have to, now we're going to make sure we want to find this icon right here. Life still add on make your own life still SMP on bedrock you want to click on it and then we're going to scroll down to the download section and we are going to click on the download button right here uh, I do want to mention bear in mind make sure to read all of this if you want if you would like to you know it gives you some basic stuff on how you are able to successfully, you know, install it, what it does, all of these recipes and all this stuff. I do want to bear in mind, this is link for ties, so do be careful, but I do have a alternative, which it is the same file, it, the, the, link for the link for ties does go to this media file link, but the media file link, which is the safest one, in my opinion, will be in the description. So, you want to download it, and we are going to click on open file. Alright, so now Minecraft is installed. It's going to say import started. That's how you know it's that the, that the plugin is ready. If it says something like fail to import or along those lines, I'm pretty sure that's just a bug. Uh, the only way I know how to fix it is to like, you know, re-import it. You click on the downloaded plugin and it should import again and that should work. If it doesn't work, feel free to put it in the comments below. Now what we're going to do is we're going to create a new world and we're going to... We'll just call it a jumbled mess and we're going to click and what we're going to do is we're going to go to resource packs and behavior packs so click on that and we're going to do life still plug life still resource pack and we're going to have to do go to behavior packs life still behavior pack now before we create the world enable all of the experiments on so enable all them on and we're going to click on create all right well now we're in now it's going to come up with this pop-up called welcome to life still welcome this world has the life still add-on installed the life still add-on was created by gamerdos on youtube do slash help to start so once that pop-up's done you can obviously close it it doesn't really you don't have to worry about it and what i'm going to do is i'm going to join on my xbox all right so now so now i'm on my xbox account as well as pc so if i quickly give myself a diamond sword or an axe and if i kill it as you can see i have gained a heart and on my xbox i have lost a heart so how do you withdraw we can go into the chat and do question mark withdraw and whatever amount you want so i'll do one give it to myself and then on my xbox all i have to do is eat it it, it might take a while and just like that my health is back to max health so there's how you're able to install it on PC. We're going to now move on to the mobile. All right, so how the gamers, I'm going to be showing you how you're able to install the live store add-on on mobile. So what we're going to have to do is we're going to go head on to Google or any search engine you have on your phone. And we're going to type in MCPEDL and we're going to tap on it. And then we're going to click on the search thing and we're going to type in live steel it has to be and it does have to be this exact word and otherwise it does not show up and we want to find this one right here lifestyle add-on make your own lifestyle smp on bedrock and we want to tap on it make sure it's by gamer dos and if it is by gamer dos we can just we can casually scroll all the way down if you would like to read any of these how any any of these kind of commands ghosts or this you feel free to but anyway we're gonna go ahead to click on link for ties download 
tap on it and then we are going to click on free access so now we should be brought onto this page so basically what you can do is we're going to zoom in and you want to make sure you you select the one that has dot mc alone onto it so hold so hold and select click on download we should be redirected here we click on that download we wait for it to install download and file we want oh that's not good so what we can do is we can head head to our file manager or file explorer whichever one you have head to downloads search up lifesteal it might be .mc add-on .zip I'm not sure why it's like that but sometimes it is and um, we're just going to head to .mc I'm just going to rename it to .mc add-on this file already, already exists because I already have it and we're going to open it with minecraft alright so now we should say import started and I obviously I already have it, so it's going to just not work. So now what we're going to do is we're going to create a new world. And we're going to head to resource packs. And we're going to enable the life still ones. And then head over down here uh, to experiment and enable all of them. And now we will create the world. Alright, so now that we're in, it's going to tell us, welcome to Lifestyle, welcome, this world has the Lifestyle add-on installed, this, li this Lifestyle add-on was created by GamerDOS on YouTube. So as I, if I quickly kill my Xbox account, so just gonna have to insane tap. Alright, so now, as you can see on the top left, I have gained a heart, and on my Xbox account, I have lost a heart. So now, you might be wondering, how do I withdraw the hearts? So what you can do is, you want to open the chat, and you want to type in, question mark, withdraw, and then the amount you want, so I'll do one. So then now, I can give it to my Xbox account, and then what I'll do is, is I'll quickly eat it. And just like that, we are both on max health. So there you go, that is how you are able to install it on mobile. We will now move on to the Xbox method. Alright, so moving on to the Xbox method. Now, with this method, it is a bit tedious and can take a while, but I'll try my best to, you know, get. What we're going to do is on the dashboard, we're going to press Y and we're going to do, and we're going to type in advan ADV file explorer now it's going to come up with this application you want to install it and once it does install it should say something like would you like to install the full trust version which is this one so yeah that's basically how you get to you know the full trust version all right so now what we're going to do is we're going to go to local packages and we're going to scroll down to microsoft.minecraft if you don't have this you can do what i did and install it in gamescom the mojo because i don't have everything because i had to manually type in these folders now i haven't now i haven't been able to to successfully done the behavior packs that could be because i misspelled it wrong but i was able to get the resource pack to work you want to make sure that you have the com.mojang file if you don't have it you can just type in every single thing i'll link a video down in the description on how you can all right so to get the plugin we're gonna have to use something called internet browser it's a free browser thing it, it, it can be a bit tedious at times for using it but it's fine and i'll set up a tiny url because you are not able to use i'm not sure why but link for ties doesn't work for me anyway so you want to do tinyurl.com slash slash mc b e l s and it's going to redirect you to to this media file thing which is the exact same one as shown on the pc and mobile thing you want to click on it in download you want to click on save and you want, and we're gonna, and it should say download complete. You wanna press and hold that. Now I've already installed this, so we're gonna click on it and save as with the three dots. We're going to go to downloads and save as. So now we're gonna head back to the advanced file explorer. So now, sorry, so now you want to head to your console. You can click on these three bookshelves thing and head to downloads. 
that there it is right here. So now what we're going to have to do is we're going to have to go all the way to the end. And we're going to have to remove MC add-on and replace it with dot zip. Click OK. Now you want to right click it. If you click on it, it's going to say this. No, you don't want to do that. You want to right click on it and do extract. And it can take a while, depending on like your internet speed and all that. Uh, so now this, so, so now the zip file is, we can just delete that. So no worries there. And then we have this folder now. Now what we're going to do is we're going to copy and click onto the star. Go to local packages. Mine, Microsoft Minecraft local state games com mojang. All right, so now we'll get. So what we'll do is we'll delete this, as I already have in here. And we can paste paste the new one, so that should be gone. And then a new one should be there. So if we refresh, there we go. New ones there. So now and then we'll head back to the free to the free bookshelves. Click. Copy the RP, which is resource packs. The BP stands for behavior packs. So do keep that in mind if you download it. So if you are downloading these. Local state, games, com mojang, resource packs. We can delete this one. So I don't because I don't really need it. And then we can paste the other one. Alright. And there we go. So now we have all of that sorted, what we now have to do is we have to head to Minecraft, so I'll head to games, and then you want to go to Minecraft, not like Minecraft Preview or Minecraft Xbox One Edition, just Minecraft. Right click on it, do manage games and add-ons, and then you want to click on uninstall all. Now, this this will only uninstall the bit, the game itself, all your save data on your accounts and all this, it's fine. So we're just going to click on uninstall, uninstall all. And as you can see, Minecraft game not installed on our save data is still there. The only time that our save data will be deleted is if we click on that, but we won't be needing to. Alright, so now we'll head to the main menu, press Y again, and we're going to type in Minecraft. And it's going to come up with a lot of stuff, so we're going to do Minecraft Starter Edition. Now, we're not going to buy it, so do not worry. We're going to scroll down to Plastic Texture Pack. Or one of these texture packs, skin packs. You want to click on them, and then one's the preview, one's the game pass one, and one's the non-game pass one. You want to get the non-game pass one. And since I own it, I can install it. And we're going to click on, and we're going to watch it install. So it's going to be about one gigabyte. This is the original one before they before they changed it to the GDK one. I'm pretty sure it's it's called. Or codenamed. So I'm going to wait for this to install and then I'll be back in a bit. Alright, so once it has installed, you want to click on it and it's going to say Minecraft needs an update. Now, I'm not sure why, but uh, it does say the size of the update will be around 0 kilobytes or something along those name names. But if it does come up with a pop up that says Minecraft needs an update, then that is good. You want to click on update. And now the update is going to be a bit bigger, it's about like 2 gigabytes now. And since it's now updating, I'm going to leave it, and I'm going to leave my Xbox on, and I'll be back in a bit <laughs> again. Alright, so now that Minecraft has updated, we want to now click on it. Alright, I was able to get that with that robot voice anime. Alright, so now what we're going to do is we're going to create a new world. And we're going to go all the way to the experiments over here, and we're going to enable all of them. Alright, and then now we're going to head to our resource pack, and we should have the resource pack just like that. And we're going to have, head to the behavior pack, and we should have it. I don't, I'm not sure, too sure why, but that doesn't matter. We have the resource pack, so it did work. So now, so now we'll just create the world, and it should be all good to go. But since I don't have the behavior pack, but since I don't have the behavior pack, it won't really work. If you do get the behavior pack and receive and resource pack to work, then that means it worked. If you need like any sort of help, like importing it, be hit like missing behavior pack or anything like that, feel free to comment down below or we'll pop it in my Discord server chat. And yeah, my name has been Sam. Nice us for us to have a good day, even on the night. And I'm out.